Hey everyone, this is a really cool Montessori material called the Edition Finger Chart. Um, in the children's house we have finger charts um, for all of the operations. Um, and then we have uh, the first finger chart, which is this one, um, and several others that increase in difficulty and encourage repetition and continued practice. But um, I want to show you how we use this first edition finger chart to solve some edition problems. Um, this is the grid paper that we use. You will need a pencil. Um, you can choose to have your child um, come up with their own addition problems and write them out here. So like, for example, um, five plus two equals. So they could come up with those problems on their own. Or you could simply have a piece of paper, write several addition problems here and invite your child to copy them onto the grid paper um, and find the sum, find the answer on their own. So I'm gonna show you how we do this. We'll start with five plus two equals. So the numbers here in the red and the blue columns represent the add-ins and then we're gonna find our answer, the sum in here. So I'm gonna use my fingers and find the first addend five. I'm gonna find our second addend two. I'm gonna bring my fingers together to find the answer. The finger on the red column is gonna move side to side. The finger in the blue column will move up and down. And where they meet, we find the sum, seven. So we would write it here. Um, Okay, let's see. Three plus five equals. I go ahead and make a check mark or cross it out to show that that one's done. Okay, three plus five. Three plus five. This one goes up and down. This one goes side to side. Equals eight. We're gonna do just one more. Two plus eight equals, check. I find two plus eight. Our sum is 10. So encourage your child to finish a whole sheet of paper. Um, you can go through and check the answers, make sure they're done correctly. Repeat as often as possible. Um, this can be really fun and an easy way to start memorizing some of those basic addition math facts. Now I'm also gonna show you our multiplication board, which looks almost identical. Um, we'll start a new sheet here. So after your child has had a lot of practice with addition, the um, multiplication is following the same sort of concept. Um, and they can do this addition, this multiplication chart in the same way. So I have some multiplication problems written out here. Five times three. Make sure they understand the um, multiplication symbol here and how that means times, whereas the addition symbol means plus. So you can go over that. Five times three equals. So we're gonna take five three times and find the sum. I'll find five and I'll find three. Same, same thing as with addition. This finger will move side to side and this will move up and down and we're going to find the product, the answer of five Three times is 15. So continue on like that. This can be a super fun activity that your child can do pretty much um, independently. Have fun.